Hey guys, welcome back to Ganchi Plans. It has been a while, but I am back, back finally again with another bedtime book review. And since it's Christmas this month, I thought I would share The Night Before Christmas by Clement Seymour, obviously. Um, this particular edition we received as a Christmas gift last year for my daughter. Um, and this is illustrated by Charles Santori, who I don't pay a lot of attention to illustrators until I'm looking up information for these videos. Um, turns out he actually passed away last year in 2019. Um, he was a very, you know, I guess famous and prolific uh, children's book illustrator, and I think it's beautiful illustrations. Um, I'm not sure exactly what he's best known for. I would say I, I saw some photos that he had done a... Um, Wizard of Oz illustration that I was familiar with. And then I think he may have done some, I'm getting conflicting information. He may have done some illustrations for a Peter Rabbit book or two, um, maybe some editions of it, but I know Beatrix Potter did some of her own illustrations as well. So, um, but anyway, he's uh, the late Charles Centauri was a very, I, I love the classic illustrations. They're a lot more fun than like some of the newer stuff. I saw an article I don't know, about how children's uh, books are having this like trend towards ugly art and it was sort of decrying that. I thought it was interesting. I don't know if I'll be able to find that to link it <laughs> below, but uh, anyway, I think I agree. I like the classic sort of illustrations. And this, of course, is the classic Christmas book. Um, you're going to want something that's nice and classic Americana kind of a vibe to it. So I just wanted to show you this. Um, this is a nice, like, soft, squishy cover with cardboard inside but it's like that that sweet spot of a board book where it's thin enough that it doesn't take up a lot of space but it's thick enough that it's not going to rip obviously um and i just really love the art in this book i love how it's borderless and so it's just a huge big copy full page art you know with uh, the the poem is like on top of it so that there's nothing lost um full page spreads of the artwork i just think it's really beautiful. It's got this sort of, like, obviously there's something very archaic about the night before Christmas, you know, things like nightcaps and, I don't know, bowls full of jelly that um, just sort of is ethereal in that, like, that way when you're reading a children's book that was written before you were born or before your parents were born. Um, so I just kind of, I like, I like that. It, uh, it has that vibe to it of like early 19th century Christmas, which is sort of what we're all looking for, I think, that aesthetic in December. And I think I, I love the warmth of the colors and all of that. I'm not gonna read this to you because you already know it though. Probably wouldn't be an issue to read it this time because I don't think that The Night Before Christmas is under copyright. Uh, but I just wanted to show you this copy. If you're looking for a copy, this would make a great gift. Uh, this is just one, like, the size of it, you pull this out and you read it a couple times during Christmas. And it's good to have, I think, a copy of some of these classics. Um, and this is one that just like, it looks great and it um, it's gonna hold up. And so I'm really glad that we got this as a gift and that we can read it to our daughter. Um, it's, you know, obviously we also have um, like nativity books as well, but you gotta have, you gotta have your Santa Claus, right? I'm not a heretic for saying you gotta love Santa Claus. That's really all I have to say today is that this is a really cool copy of The Night Before Christmas. If you're looking for a good one that's for a gift, this would be, I think, a good choice. Um, and there's a link to it in my bookshop.org account down below in the description if you wanted to um, find it to purchase as a gift for yourself or for your children. That's really all. This is a super short one because you all know, you know this poem. Everyone knows this poem, but I wanted to do something a little bit Christmassy as the first one back because it seemed like too good an opportunity to pass up. So I uh, do one of these book review videos every month. So if you have any children's book review, children's books that you would like me to review, anything that you think is particularly good that I should check out, I'm always on the lookout for good new books for my girls. So link those or just comment them down below and I will check them out and maybe do a future video about them. Also, don't forget to subscribe. I post videos twice a week, so I'll see you in the next one on Sunday. Bye.